This video was made possible in part by these fine people. Hey Techies, Anthony from Action here. Today we're going to take a look at this Amazon Vine product. It is a ergonomic, I'm using air quotes, I haven't even opened the box yet, uh, mouse. Uh, wireless, of course, since you see the dongle here. And um, the box came beat up like this. Uh, I don't just randomly beat up boxes. Uh, it is obviously from out of country. It looks Chinese. So, I mean, let me know in the comments if I'm wrong on what the language is. It's just, it looks Chinese. Um, so, it's a 2.4 gigahertz, 2000 DPI, uh, compatible with Windows 11, 10, and Mac OS, and Chrome OS. So, great. Let's open up the box. Uh, apparently, I'm going to need a pair of scissors. Alrighty, so cut that. Pull the tab. Oh, okay, it's a... Uh, Cardboard uh, case. Oh, okay. It's I just pull this out. Now I have a razor mouse I bought a few years ago. Uh, it worked up until there was an update, and then it stopped working. So um, I don't use it anymore. I used the Dell mouse that came with my computer back in 2020. Let's uh, open this up. I'm gonna assume the dongle is inside. Oh, yeah. Let's take a look at it. So, Ellicom is the company for this one, and I guess it's called this a Shelfa. So, uh, feels decent. It might be a little small for me, but, uh, yeah. So, uh, let's see how it feels. Oh, it's a very quiet click. I, I probably can't hear that. Super quiet. It's smooth, it's smooth though, like uh, to do that. So let's open this up. There is actually a battery in it, and and here is the USB dongle. So um, it's weird that they would include the battery. I'd be worried something that you're shipping overseas. So I think what we're gonna do is test out the computer. Uh, since it uses a dongle, it's, it's not gonna work on an Android and. So it really is a real simple test, and uh, so we'll give that a try. Less than 50% of viewers have subscribed to this channel. Please consider clicking that subscribe button to get us one step closer to monetization. Thank you for watching. Okay, so we, we have the mouse, and we're going to put the AA battery in. And we already put the, um, the adapter into the computer's USB port. We're going to close it up, and then there is an on switch. And it's a blue laser. Hopefully this works. Uh, oh, there's a mouse. So uh, let's try a couple of things as I move my other mouse away. Uh, so as you can see, I have a number of screens set up here. Uh, wow. Now, you probably can't hear it. it it's, I'm clicking it, but it's not doing anything. It's like you can see I'm doing stuff, but you're not hearing it. So um, let's see if I right-click. Everything's there. Cool. Uh, let's refresh. Okay, cool. Let's open up a, a web page. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's do uh, Google. Um, feeling lucky. Places to eat. Uh, sure. Um, it rolls right. Okay, let's see if I do this. Okay, uh, the mouse look is good. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, and it scrolls laterally too. Oh, although it's... Does the wheel isn't big enough for uh, me to scroll laterally without accidentally touching one of the buttons. Uh, there's just not a lot of clearance. Now let's see, what is... The other two buttons don't do anything. So uh, let's see in the instructions if there's a way to program them. Okay, so um, everything was in Chinese, and as we saw at the beginning, there was no actual paper instructions, so I couldn't read the box. So I'm kind of curious uh, what um, setting is there like mouse settings? If I could type in mouse settings, would there, yeah, would there be a set of something that I can do to program the additional mouse options? Let's see. 
move that over here. I know you really can't see it, but I'm going to see if there is. No, I don't, I don't see anything that lets me set it. So I don't know if there was instructions at some point. Maybe I just got it one without instructions. But it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to use the, the side keys. But um, holding it in my hand uh, and using it, it um, I just rest my wrist on the mouse pad as I normally would. And um, the quietness of it is interesting. So, I mean, the fact that um, can't read any of the instructions, that's kind of a downer. But uh, it, is, it is smooth. It's quiet. Um, maybe not necessarily meant for somebody with larger hands. Um, so keep that in mind. Uh, but um, it, sc it scrolls fine. It's, it, uh, the clicks are silent almost. Uh, it's kind of weird when you're used to he audibly hearing if your click is recognized, you know, uh, audibly and then you'll see it on the screen. Like, if, if I couldn't hear it and nothing happened on screen, I'd obviously think the mouse was at fault. So, um, it's just, it, it, it does what it's supposed to, and uh, I can highlight areas, you know, I can scroll, uh, I can laterally move, um, so, I mean, that's great, but, uh, yeah, I, I just, the, the, the size and the inability to program those, la those two side buttons, you know, that, that's probably, uh, probably why this is not going to get a perfect rating. With that said, tell me in the comments your thoughts on this item. Did you get it, and how was your experience with it? Thanks for watching, and please remember to like and subscribe.